got me scooped! Oh, oh, mercy! 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 Treasure, are you? You wicked twerp! But I, I can't be handing it over to you for free. Come, easy there. I'll need a. Easy there. I'll need a bit of time to get restocked. This putrid rat meat is insufferable! Help me score a tasty treat, will you? Uh, drive me mad! I've been craving a taste of that juicy jade lotus. Can you find me some in this barren land? Oh, I wouldn't mind some meatless meals from time to time. 
Hmm, I have stumbled upon some interesting leads. The realm of gold does hold a connection to this desolate land. I hear the realm of gold is where the sun sets. There, they held rats above all others. Hmm, and somehow, before we knew it, the realm was gone. Quite odd, that is. Hmm. I just tried those rat guys. They taste like men flesh. Hmm. Its people are not yet extinct. I suspect the yellow wind guai had a role in their downfall. Our senior brother gave me a piece of gold. I'll need it here when the time's right, he said. Hmm. It's the right time now. I'm taking it to the right place to give it a try. Hmm. I just tried those rat guys. They taste like men flesh. Intensity! <laughs> this is good. You and I should explore that realm together. I...
Men in our time do not see the ancient moon. But this moon hath shone on men of yore. Behold! Be it the realm of sunset or the realm of gold, it's but an echo of the past. Legends speak of an ancient, colossal beetle in these sands. Whilst deep in slumber, it lay hidden beneath the Earth's embrace. When awakened, it would devour all souls that crossed its path. Its shell, harder than stone, defied the strikes of common arms. It struck fear into traveling merchants and wider to neighboring realms. But a yellow-furred rat sensed the immense power emanating from the insect. He halted the beetle's havoc and harnessed it for his own ends. Overjoyed, the king named the rat Gwai, the royal sage, and built a shrine in his honor. The bound beetle was a perfect source of power, so the rat stayed. He seized the tongue monk using the new power and battled with Soon Wukong upon the Yellow Wind Ridge. The Gwai's formidable wings veiled the vast expanse of the sky. Were it not for Bodhisattva Lingji, Tongue Monk's quest for the scriptures would have failed. Yet, stripped of the rat's protection, the kingdom was plunged into a state of ruin. The once lush Yellow Wind Ridge now lies a desolate wasteland. <laughs>